Well, I think there, there are a couple of questions. One, in the, in the regular course of Congress, there are certainly people who advocate this when, when there is no emergency. Uh, I, I'm more skeptical of that. I think there, there are real reasons for wanting Congress to be here and operate the way it usually does in normal times. Uh, Congress literally means a coming together. Uh, and for, for all of these members from different districts and different states to come here and talk to each other, to bargain, to, to vote, to have a lot of the back and forth that goes on in Congress, that's the best scenario. Uh, if we are gonna move to a remote voting, uh, a remote Congress, I think we're gonna have to have some limited uh, aspirations for what we do. People maybe think of the roll call votes being one very important aspect of it. But of course, there's a lot else that goes on. The ability to offer amendments, uh, the ability to offer motions, a lot of the behind the scenes things. So we may wanna incorporate some aspects of a formal voting online from afar. Uh, we certainly want to boost up our communications technology, both publicly, but also privately, so that members can talk to each other and to staff. But I don't think that it's realistic to think that we're gonna take Congress as it is today and just replicate it in the digital realm, uh, especially in short notice. Uh, and, and some people, I think myself, would argue that it wouldn't be a good thing in the non-emergency times but we still have to have a plan to do something of this to make sure that Congress is able to weigh in if it gets bad out there. Well, I do think we are gonna, we are gonna have more uh, communication, especially for hearings, for a lot of the regular business that's gonna go on in Congress, because we're gonna see this period of time in the next few weeks and probably over the summer where Congress is really not gonna wanna be here as much as it usually did. Um, I think we may also see some, some more formal remote voting, but that is a little more difficult uh, to implement. And I, I do think Congress will try to come back when it can, and we just don't know when that is. So uh, I do think though that the idea of members being able to communicate, to have committee, these meetings, hearings, something like that uh, by digital mechanism is absolutely going to happen. Uh, and I think that something uh, related to congressional voting may happen if we are out a long extended period of time.